Hi everyone, it's Artie Lyons coming at you from my channel. Um, you probably wondered when I would get to this video about uh, Shurricane 2, uh, Black Ops on the Black Dragon. Uh, it's quite an amazing book. Uh, took me a better part of three years to write. And it's, it really shows in that book the mindset of a black operation and also the black operatives that are involved in, in that operation. I mean, because this is like highly covert, right? Uh, when, you, when you think about covert, is, is very, it's secret, okay? So nobody knows unless they need to know on a need to know basis. They have uh, they're classified the highest classification level from the Pentagon. So not to spoil the, the book for you, but uh, in the in the first book, Shurikane, um, Shurikane, uh who is Mac Matthews, he he was up against something. Uh, that was almost insurmountable uh, for him because he didn't only have to deal with a voodoo priest that was a, a super, like a, a mega terrorist that in that infiltrated into the United States through Europe or or you know for Asia from Asia, uh, but um, he also dealt had to deal with the powerhouse that was even maybe even more powerful than him who that was was electro and electro uh he he was electromagnetic uh muted so shurking on the other hand he became electromagnetic by accident he he got hit by an emp being and even though it St uh, stopped his heart twice. He was. He, they managed to bring him back from from the dead. Right. So, um, getting into uh, the second book, uh, Sure Kane. Uh, he um, he in in the in the end of the first book, uh, Sure Kane, uh, one uh, Super Ninja, uh, Mac. Matthews, uh, he goes into a coma because he has this big fight with Electro at the end of the book. And um, so, if 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 you um, if you want to read the first book, I I'd I'd, um, I'd really recommend it because it will lay the groundwork for the second book, which is Sure King Two. And uh, in, in that first book, you learn that he has a very special relationship with his grandfather. His grandfather is actually taking him under his wing after he's been hit by that EMP beam because he kind of feels like he feels uh, responsible, right? Because it was supposed to be just um, a very, you know, safe kind of... Um, experiment that uh, used with the leg electromagnetic energy but uh, something went wrong because the generator was upgraded and nobody was there to really shut it off when it when it started uh over loading so anyhow getting to shuriken too um mac matthews is in a coma and he's all of a sudden, he's shaken out of the coma. Uh, it's like, you know, something deep inside him is screaming at him, saying that something is really wrong. Something's wrong in Japan. So um, he awakes, and it's like, you know, he was holding his breath all, like, for weeks underwater. And it's, it's amazing that... Um, this kind of knocks him out of the coma. Like it just knocks some sense into him. Literally, like he gets his five senses back and then some, right? His extra sensory perception too. Like his, uh, in ninjutsu, you call it halage. 
Panagate is is uh, is actually like a ninja ESP. So he finds out that something terribly wrong happened to his grandfather. He goes over to Japan and he he receives something very sacred but something very powerful from him and unfortunately he doesn't make it i'm not going to tell you the details of what's happened but um so you know like he he's in um he's in a place now where he has to kind of carry on uh from what uh what his grandfather was doing like kind of but not just that he um he has kind of sworn his his honor by honor and and uh by his his code um to uphold the security of the united states of america so when that is jeopardized and threatened to a great to, uh, to an extreme degree then he goes into action they have to um you know they have to move uh quickly because time is running out to find um well, you could say a small nuclear device that was, you know, stolen and could be in in the hands of mega terrorists that could start something, maybe even, uh, you know, a nuclear Armageddon. So, um, this is really serious, uh, it gets serious, but it's very, a lot of action too, because, uh, the person behind, uh, um, that has behind the scenes that has actually stolen this, he's very, very powerful, but he's also related to the person that was the villain in the first book, right? So, um, now it now it gets really interesting because um I don't know if you're not you're familiar with the black dragons they are truly um they're not fiction they're more non fiction it's more uh more true than not true about them so you know they're you know you, you might think about the triads or uh, you know an asian kind of mafia but the, the black dragons, I would say, are even more powerful than, than that. But then there's the white dragons too, right? So uh, it's, it's amazing how, you know, how this, how my book is kind of tied into like reality almost because there's, there is things, uh, there is like uh, upheaval and there are um, kind of secret wars going on in the South china sea and i've actually written about this in my book and it's it's not that i knew about this because this was like back in 2000 and uh 2009 uh or not 2009 sorry 2012 when i started really writing this so um you know they weren't even talking about the south china sea too much uh but lately they they are now because uh, you know they're fighting over or land and there's all kinds of things going on there but you know a lot of the stuff we don't know about and it's because it's covert right and so um getting getting to the the reason to 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 actually read this book is actually if you if you like spy thrillers and you like action and suspense and you also like like military action or or like um covert um operations like black operations uh, you will know that you know with boot like black ops on terrorists uh they they are sanctioned or from to the highest level uh to like there's a general named general thorough and he's at, like the five-star general right up there with the secretary of state and uh next to the president right so he's like he's the head honcho guy from the pentagon so he authorizes you know like strike missions and those kinds of things 
So it's it's amazing um, that uh, the, these kinds of things happen in the book. But there's also like you know people are trying to kill Mac, you know, and um, I can't really tell you why, but um, it it's a mystery in that it 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 involves his grandfather because his grandfather was you know something he was taken out so. Um, I'm not going to tell you too much more about this, but I do recommend you to read the book. First of all, I recommend you to get Shuriken, Shuriken Super Ninja, because then you will actually know um, the foundation of, you will get a really good idea of what, 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 what the story is all about and, and in the timeline, right? And how it, how it relates to the second book which is quite amazing. Um, everything else will, uh, it will be like a jigsaw puzzle that will, you'll have all the pieces. So you'll see the whole picture of what's going on, right? And what, what what's really taking place. So I'll leave, I'll leave you with that right now. And uh, yeah, uh, right now I have a spring sale on, it's up to 40% off, 40% off the book. Um, Black Ops on the Black Dragon, uh, shirking to the Shinobi. So you'll learn who the Shinobi is too. Um, you know, uh, you might say it might be Mac, but it might again too. It might be someone, might be someone else. So you have to read the book to find out. And <laughs> and this is amazing too because this book has a super super huge fire dragon in the book okay so if you like dragons you'll love this book because it's black ops on the black dragon but the black dragon has nothing to do with this fire dragon so there's a riddle for you so i'll leave it with you right now and uh if you want to go to lulu press uh which is lulu.com forward slash small cap spotlight forward slash capital r D, capital D, capital L, Y, small caps, Y O N S. You'll 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 get my spotlight channel, and then you'll be able to uh, check out the book and 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 buy it for up to forty percent. I think it's like yeah, I think it's like forty percent off right now on the Super Spring Sale. It's awesome, so don't miss out. Okay, all right. Have a good night. See you, R D. Same. Good night.